Hello, and thank you for being here for day three of the Magic is Real Manifesting Challenge. On day one, I had you look at some of the blocks and negative self-talk that might be holding you back. And then I asked you to find the opposite of that negative core belief and turn it into a positive affirmation. Then yesterday, day two, we did a 10-minute ish meditation to just kind of get you in the groove. So today I'm going to have you do two things. One is gratitude. Gratitude is everything. And so it's really important to focus on what we do have and not what we don't have. So it's not about, oh, I'll be happy when I have this thing. It's about being happy before you even have a thing and understanding that you already have so many blessings. Your life isn't perfect because no one's is. But let's really turn our attention to the things that we are content with, grateful for. And so this is just a simple exercise of writing down 10 things that you're grateful for today. Easy, right? And the second thing is I'm going to have you take those affirmations from day one. And here's the thing about manifesting. You'll hear lots of manifestation coaches talk about these um, different techniques, but it's not about the technique. It's about the intention the techniques are just there to help us feel good. So really, this doesn't matter how you do it, but I, there's no magic to writing things down and putting them under your pillow, except if you believe that it works. So if you believe it, you know, just fake it till you make it and, and do what feels right for you. For me, I tend to like to speak my affirmations out loud. So writing them down is really great. And I do that too, just to kind of reinforce that there is something about writing it down that cements uh, information into your brain. So that's a really good technique. I sometimes like to go on a hike. Well, I mean, I go hiking all the time by myself and literally when no one's around and I'm just with nature, I'll just say my affirmations out loud. I am healthy. I am abundant. Money comes to me from unexpected sources. I am love. I am radiant. I'm successful. All the things that I want to manifest for myself. And it just kind of helps get my vibe up. But here's another thing I like to do. I like to light candles and have a little ceremony around it. You don't have to do this, but I just do it because it feels good. So I would take those affirmations and even write them down again if you like. Burn a candle, unless you're allergic to them or something, um, but or just some dim lighting. Put on some binaural beats. Music can affect our mood. It can affect our vibration. So you might want to look up a particular hertz to see what you're like, you know, if it's, I sometimes just look up manifesting music or music for abundance or music for love or whatever it is, put that on, get yourself cozy, showered in your pajamas and just sit quietly. And then I like to light a candle and just sit listening to this music and kind of zoning out and just writing these affirmations down. If you've already done that, great. You might even just read them out loud, but here's the, the trick. It's not just about saying the words. It's about feeling the feelings. So when you write down your affirmations, write them as if you already have them. So some of, the, some of them may already be happening, but some may be things that feel like they're out of reach for you. And that's okay. Just say, thank you so much for the $10,000 that I received this month. Even if in the 3D, you didn't see that. And then let that feeling sink in. What does it feel like to look in your bank account? I like to visualize. Some people aren't great at visualizing, but that's okay. Just imagine how you would feel if you looked at your bank account and had whatever amount of money seems like a lot to you or would give you that sense of peace and stability and, and comfort. And I just like to imagine it. So whatever it is, I am so excited that I have $10,000 in my bank account right now and then just sit with that feeling and I'm so excited that I feel energetic. I'm feeling healthy. I'm healing from that ailment. I am in the most fulfilling, passionate, exciting, committed relationship. Whatever your dream is, just keep saying it out loud. Keep repeating it and kind of go into meditation about it. So that's what I like to do is just get myself into a peaceful place, listen to peaceful music, listen to binaural beats, and just kind of affirm, affirm, affirm. I am whole. I am healthy. I am healed. I am growing. I have the job of my dreams. And you just keep saying it out loud or writing it down. Really, whatever feels good to you. It's not the technique. As I said, it's the intention. It's the feeling. Feel it real. 
So today, maybe in the morning you want to do a gratitude list. Maybe after work you want to just chill out at night and put all the lights down and just light some candles and do a little ceremony. And you know what you can even do is write down the affirmations, watch a candle burn. And then if you want to go go someplace safe, like outside, I have a dirt dirt in my front and I like to burn ceremonially, just burn what I've written down and just say, and so it is. So it's not about the ritual. It's about the feeling of this is coming. This is happening. Creation is happening now. There is no time on the other side. Everything's happening everywhere all at once. So when people say, oh, God created everything, you can think of it as God is creating it now. There is no past, present, or future. This is all creation happening right now. So if you keep that in your mind and just feel into your soul's power that, look, we all live in this 3D world. It is very real while we're here. But just remember, you are a ball of light made of stardust, sink into that sense of personal power and embody what you want to become. And you can even just add little things in like, I am light, I am love, I am worthy, I am whole, I am God. And whatever brings your vibration up, it's going to work. So keep doing it. And then let me know in the comments how it went for you today, but also over time. Just keep that vibration up. It doesn't mean be in denial about things that are happening and not acknowledging them, but there is something to continue to tell yourself, I'm safe, I'm safe, I'm abundant, money's coming, I have money in my bank account. So report back, let me know how you're doing, and thanks so much for doing this with me.